Hi now, it's Brittany here with the Stato Social Recap, here with the latest on what's happening in the Stato community. Let's get started. I find October on Stato to be a particularly creative month for a multitude of reasons, the first being that Halloween is just around the corner, along with Miss Stato World of course. So Miss Stato World is back for 2019, and it's a little bit different this time. Paying homage to 10 years of the event, a special store has been set up in Museum Mile, which features various items from throughout the decade. So if you weren't able to get some items back all those years ago, now's your chance. There is also a wonderful series of community made content surrounding Miss Data World too. I remember when Miss Data World was this brand new and exciting event and it's hard to believe that it's been 10 years but here we are. Best of luck to everyone campaigning this year and be sure to support your favourite dolls to help get them to the next stage. Another element of October is Pink October for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. It was suggested by this wonderful doll that I share some perfect pink stylings and I think that is a lovely idea. Pink itself is a lovely colour. It can be intense and bright but also quite subtle and soft depending on how you style it. I always find it so exciting to see the creative ideas and stylings that are going towards a great cause and I'm very excited to be able to share this here too. So being a huge fan of Tokyo street fashion myself, it was awesome to see the new windows in the world focusing on Japan. The multicolored jacket in particular has been a hot item recently and it has been styled in so many different ways in thanks to its bright colors and bold silhouette. We also had Kelly Con return for 2019. The exclusive items were really cute too and there was such a plethora of events surrounding it from contests, store releases, staff Q&As and interviews. It's always great seeing dolls get into the spirit with star designs and stylings too. Calicon does a good job of showing some of the behind the scenes workings on what it takes to make a website like Stardoll and I'm looking forward to seeing this event again in the future. I did mention Halloween earlier in the video and I think it would be a nice way to finish it off. Dolls are embracing the spooky side of fashion and creating these very intricate and incredible sweet designs and costumes. I personally love it when things get a bit surreal and crazy but it's also fun to see the more cute and bubbly side of things too. I am definitely looking forward to seeing more as October progresses. As always dolls, share your Stardoll creations to the Stardoll and Stardoll social recap hashtags and I would like to thank these lovely dolls for sharing their suggestions on what should go into this week's video. I'm always happy to to hear what you would like me to feature in these episodes or even something to add to the videos so feel free to either contact me on my socials or even in the comments down below. I hope you'll have a wonderful day dolls. Thanks for watching. Until next time.